A poem for every person I have ever kissed. One. It's been eight years, and to this day I still sometimes wonder if you have discovered what a toothbrush is, too. <laughs> we were only 14, but I think we were in love for those few months. That is, if 14-year-olds even know what love is, you moved away. I didn't hear from you for years. Three, your brother tasted better, and he was the one who probably needed a toothbrush. Four, you stomped on my tiny heart. Your lips were made of venom. Five, I'm sorry, I don't think I can kiss girls. Six, maybe I can kiss girls when they taste like you. Your lips were like cherries, your hair was like silk on my cheeks. Seven, I wasted nearly four years kissing you. I had to use an entire bottle of mouthwash to get your taste off my tongue. Actually, fuck that seven, you don't even deserve a line in this poem. Eight, we spent a summer beneath the stars. With beer-infused kisses and loud punk music and a loud love so hard, I spent months sweating you out of my system. The withdrawal from music losing you was worse than any drug we ever did together. Nine, we were drunk, and I could practically feel your boyfriend's eyes on us from across the dance floor. I guess he finally knows you're not completely straight. <laughs> Ten, you kissed me for the first time in the fall. My favorite season. Soon you became my favorite season all on your own. And I know this cliche, and I'm sorry, and maybe the fact that you made my poet poetry so fucking cliche is the reason I had to leave you. Eleven, you deserve more than I could ever give you two. After you moved away, my mother said that if it was meant to be, you'd come back. Seven years later, you found yourself on my doorstep. Two. Just the thought of you makes me nervous, too. I forget how to count when I get nervous, too. You were the second boy I ever kissed. But you are still my number one. Thank you. <laughs>